we believe we have some idea as to why he's lasted this long. Bob Bolton has been walking alongside his dad for a long time. We uh, spent a lot of time, uh, as much as possible actually, out in the mountains together when I was a kid. That was when I could sort of dominate his attention. Uh, other, t other times, of course, at home, there was the phone that dominated his attention. <laughs> Doctor, musician, and military vet Earl Bolton just keeps climbing. In age, that is. A uh, hundred and uh, six. He's, he's starting to forget. <laughs> there was no apparent genetic reason for him to last this long because his family died at normal ages. According to his family, Earl is the oldest known man in Clark County and second oldest in Washington. Born in 1914, his parents moved to eastern Washington in the 20s. Earl now lives in Salmon Creek. This is his church in southeast Portland. He has no diseases that most people get at age, at old age like this. Tell the people how many headaches you've had. Um, one. Is he sitting next to you? <laughs> <laughs> the Boltons have taken the pandemic very seriously, managing to avoid COVID. Pandemic. It's kind of scary. Earl climbed Mount St. Helens and Mount Rainier in the 50s. Even Bob at 74 is an accomplished mountaineer. 70 years ago, they summited Mount Pilchuck together. And 50 years later, they did it again. Out in the wilderness, you know, to me is really living. Adding to his list of feats, Earl got vaccinated back in March while dodging any side effects. He credits three things for his long full life, a vegetarian diet, staying active, and studying the Bible. And I uh, put them into practice uh, for many, many years now. In Southeast Portland, John Goodwin, KGW News.